Once the application is started, we create a new file with PCE extension. Activate the point clouds ribbon and select the cloud file to import, which in this case will be a LAS file. After import, the point cloud is displayed, by default with natural color-based symbology. With the mouse buttons we can rotate, move and expand the view intuitively. We can also use the icons of the display toolbar, to zoom in and out, zoom window or zoom extent. With the level button we keep the z-axis vertical. We can switch between orthographic and perspective views for a more realistic display. If the density of the point cloud is not sufficient, these controls allow us to increase or decrease the size of the points. Now let's look at the properties of the point cloud. To do this, select the cloud and press the properties button. We see that they have color and category attributes. Now let's modify the representation of the point cloud, so that the colors depend on the elevations of the points. The application allows us to configure the color palette and rendering ranges, we apply and change the symbology of the cloud. 